So another method for extracting water from the moon's surface might be an apparatus like a sweeper where it's going to sweep rocks into it and then maybe it crushes them, breaks them down somehow, and then extracts the water from those rocks. So this is the um, sweeper and there are no building instructions for the complete model. So if you need help building it, you can look at the pictures on uh, the WeDo app. So on here, if you click on the light bulb and you scroll down, you have uh, the sweep right here. And there are building instructions for this part, but if you want to get to um, the, next, the next part where there's the actual street sweeper, sorry, let me navigate back there. So uh, right over here, the floor sweeper, or even the sea cleaner, either one of these, there are only pictures. So you can view it from three different angles uh, and try to recreate it there. I have a building tutorial that you can watch if you wanna know more about how to build the actual sweeper model. And so what I'm gonna do with my sweeper is I'm just gonna program it to sweep and when this spins, just because of the way that these rubber bands are attached, it's going to, as this turns, the rubber bands turn and will pull on the uh, little bushing that's right here, causing this whole thing to spin underneath. Now, depending on how we twist the rubber bands, so let me hit play, we can get this right here where they're both where they're going, one's going clockwise, one's going counterclockwise, and it's kind of sweeping it underneath. Uh, if I reverse my program on here, so if I reverse it, so it's going the other direction and I hit play. Oops, I think I, let me hit this again. So it's going this way, hit play. There you go. Now it's pushing out, so anything here would be pushed out. Or if I rotate my rubber band, just one of my rubber bands on here. Now they will both be in unison. And when I hit play, now they're spinning together like you would want maybe on a helicopter. So both are spinning in the same direction. Now for our sweeper, if this is gathering rocks and sweeping it underneath, we want it feeding inside. So we're gonna have it where there we go. So anything that comes right here is gonna get swept up underneath the machine. There's no motor to drive it, it's all hand driven. So we're just gonna hand drive this into our pile of rocks. Hopefully we get the water that's underneath. Let's see what happens. I drive forward. Well, there we go. We kind of swept it up a little bit. We might've kicked the water out a little bit, but you saw that it was kind of sweeping things underneath it. See how it's shoving it through? So we're shoving things that are back. Now, again, like I said, if we switch the motor direction, now it's pushing, and so we can actually push things out of the way. So maybe this is another great invention for our moon base to maybe push some rocks away from our lunar surface. Anyways, those are the two builds for extracting water from the surface of the moon and maybe you can come up with your own invention for how you would go about maybe searching the lunar surface for water so that we don't have to bring it from Earth. All right, have fun.